long time coming here, and this is a big day for families in Detroit waiting to shop at a new Whole Foods store close to their homes. The grand opening came just a few hours ago in Midtown, and 7 Action News reporter Nima Shafe shows us how people are welcoming their new neighbor. The line is long. These folks have waited a long time for a grocery store here in Midtown, and this is their newest neighbor, and they're all excited. Ralph Waldo Emerson once said, nothing great is ever achieved without enthusiasm. And the employees of the new Midtown Whole Foods have it and are pumped to share it. <laughs> Hundreds rushed the store around 9 this morning when the doors officially opened. The long line barely an issue when you think about the free food, the music, and all the vendors all out ready to help these people have a good time. What's the excitement? Detroit. <laughs> this Whole Foods is finally down in the city of Detroit in Corktown. So it's a new thing. And we've been getting so long for it. So <laughs> we're excited. We're happy. And you guys got some food. Don't look at that. <laughs> <laughs> It's gluten free. The area has waited a long time for the store. The goal of Whole Foods showcase locally grown and locally raised fresh fruits, vegetables, and meats. It's an idea that all these people love. So you brought your wallet? Yes, I did. <laughs> are you ready? Are you ready to spend a lot of money? I certainly am. I love Whole Foods. The sea of people inside the store? A sign. A sign they've waited and waited, and their time has come. And remember this? The excitement of the employees ready to welcome all of you? The president and CEO, Walter Robb, says this is just the beginning for Detroiters. You see our team. You see the quality of our folks. You see the quality of their connection. And, and um, uh, this is very, very, you know, I don't want to break down and cry on your show, but it's uh, for what this means to our company and what it means to, uh, it, it's just, it's uh, really beyond words. So, In Detroit, Nima Shafe, 7 Action News.